Okay, so I'm using uh, Chiro Marchetti's deck again, and I'm going to focus in on Bill Barr mostly. Let's, you know, of course do the update on him. Uh, will he be charged for, charged, well, tried, <laughs> tried for covering up, tried and charged? <laughs> uh, Josephine's question is, will he be tried for covering up financial crimes by Trump? And I do have a, a, a playlist for, for Bill Barr, but this will be an update. And so the main man would be his card if it comes through. And the uh, uh, the other one, the older guy, you know, the supportive older man, that I will assign, if that card comes through, that'll be Durham. Is his name John Durham, I think? Okay, so let's see. What is the truth? I've got the future for Bill Barr and Durham for covering up. I mean, it's it's bad. He he did. I always that guy just drove me nuts. I mean, chopstick over here. Oh, and it's the reason things went. You know, were covered up and stuffed under for so long. Okay, Bill Barr. Bill Barr's future. From the end of January 2023, uh, forward. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There's our top row. Oh, they all seem to be up here. Twelve. Thirteen. Sixteen. Seventeen. Wow. Okay. Usually they're not all lumped together, but this one was. So let's see what's at the bottom as well. Okay. Oops. I'm not going to do that. There we go. So this is the rat row card. So that's his wife. Interesting. Six, seven. Okay. Now this part will go faster. Oh yeah, I've, I've often gotten these cards for him using the Kipper. Major health problems that have him really restricted in his body. Can't say I feel sorry for him. I try to have compassion for these people, but... This might be his book that he wrote. You know, like he... Like he's... Uh, somebody who has any integrity. Okay, so right in the center we will see that he's been a major distraction, that he robbed the United States of America of any justice while he was there. And that was his strategy all along. His wife is uh, a major, I mean, she's really bonded to him tightly. His wife and a daughter, and a, at least one of his daughters, if he has more than one. I think, didn't his uh, son-in-law work for, uh, I don't have his card coming through, unless it's down there on the bottom, but, uh, or over there on the bottom. But didn't his son-in-law work for the Trump administration, and maybe the daughter, too? I thought that he had a daughter that had a major health issue, so that might be there. Maybe it's his wife. There's something about his wife knowing and ha having a lot of communication 
Is his wife connected? Was his wife connected with Jenny Thomas? Or is this mature woman someone who brought in uh, a lot of information that, that could... Wow, there is so much here. I need to get back over here, but right here, I want, I want to, let's focus over here. So, in his future, he's, he's going to be feeling very, um, you know, there's going to be some, some, something comes through that's painful to him. There's going to be some crisis or confrontation that he's going to have to go through. And it might have to do with some woman an older woman that knows, well, anybody over 50, and maybe it's a friend of uh, his wife's, his wife, that uh, somehow restricts his, not only his health, but his happiness, his creativity, something with the mother and the daughter, and a bunch of communications, but this could be his book that he's written. But he, he's going to have sad news, I think, about his wife sneaking up. She's here, and that's kind of moving in this direction, that her and someone else is going to bring sadness, or there's some sadness about uh, his wife and whomever this person is. Okay, interesting. Whomever this person is, is a, a close, a, either a close family member or someone that lives with them. And they don't get out much. Maybe, do, it, maybe his wife has agoraphobia and she doesn't get out. I don't know. But there's a lot of pain and restriction and secrets about his family. This is also the imprisonment card. Uh, notice we don't have any, I don't have adjudication or a trial or anything. Instead, it looks to me like it's all about his health. Like he wouldn't even make it that far to go through a trial. And maybe they won't even bother with it because there's so much going on. That's what I'm getting here. But nevertheless, it doesn't, you know, here, here's, this is all his future. And this card here, the imprisonment card, is all about secrets and uh, your self-created prison and feeling all, all alone and uh, a place where you go to, to, you know, avoid. I mean, I don't think his wife will be throwing him in prison. I think his wife doesn't really have much of a connection with him. That's what I'm getting here. Maybe he cheated on his wife with whomever, whomever this younger woman might be. Maybe there's that in there. You know, maybe he's one of those. He's always looked to me like a little sadomasochistic dude. So, anyway. His intimate circle of friends and family members will bring sadness and they might be receiving sadness. This can be our card of getting a subpoena or an indictment. Now remember, an indictment is only an accusation and you have to go through grand jury trials, sometimes more than one, to get to the end of it and it takes a long time. I don't see him living past it, uh, honestly. Uh, so, sadness and helplessness within their family. Everything here is about him and his family is what I'm getting. And then smack dab right in the middle with this uh, thievery card here, we have him receiving some kind of a loss due to his irresponsibility. Because it knights down here to this message card, I feel like this is his book, the message he was trying to get out with his book. Well, nobody fucking cares, dude. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> nobody wants to read your book. The, any, any MAGA, my God, you know, supporters, are they don't read. 
and and uh, you know I doubt he has very many fans. So even if it made it to some bestsellers list, which doesn't look to me by these cards that it has, uh, he he's making some money off of it, and that was a big strategy. But nobody believes anything he says. Uh, and whomever this woman here is, she has stolen from him and made a lot of money. And I don't know who she is. Might have been, you know, a publisher or I don't know. Uh, who knows? The mature woman often holds secrets. And, yeah, but there's there's a lot. There's Money has been made. We do have, you know, three of the money cards here. This card can sometimes just be, uh, like, like you know, you can see right here, a gift, or it could be a visit, a visitor. But anyway, back to this thievery card. So this is a really interesting card. It carries a lot of different meanings. It can just be some major deficiency within a person. It can also be, uh, which, you know, his wife is up here, and their marriage and it can also be uh, a card of just a tremendous amount of negativity and uh, you know people that just suck the energy out of a room people who just you know drain you and that that was him that's he just walked around all the time and you know said whatever he, well, he held back everything. I mean, we know what he, he's done. I don't need to keep bagging on him. But so, but as far as him being charged for covering up financial crimes, well, I just, it's, I, I'm not totally seeing it. I am seeing, though, however, he's trying to leave his, and I'm saying this in quotes, legacy uh, to, like, family members, but I think the guy's reputation is just as someone who has taken all he can and who has risked, uh, been very, very risky, but he's had all the teamwork to do it and is all about making money. And I kind of see him getting away with it with these cards here. But not with his health. I don't see him locked up. I don't even have the adjudication card here. Let's see what's at the bottom. So he's on this soul journey. So I'm going to read directionally here. He's on this soul journey into uh, the, the, his poverty of mind and consciousness. Oh, now here we do. Maybe here there is. Okay, so maybe there is some discovery. Maybe I should do it this way. Leave that thievery card there. Remember, you know, his whole family's in on it too. This can be the adjudication card would be the examination. And then of favors and quid pro quo. Of course, it would dog him and drive him nuts. And then other people that were involved, but then years years down the line, something that develops about all of his deception. So that it, it's possible. It is possible, but it's still notice that the um, imprisonment card came through in the beginning and it's more about his bad health. Uh, let's see, let, let me reshuffle and ask for a different way, but I, I of course will not do 21 cards. Hold on, I'll drop the camera down a bit. We are back. Okay, so I'm just going to do 10 cards and ask, will we see justice with Bill Barr? Will we see him paying the price? See, because that's the thing with karma and paying the price. Often we don't, it doesn't happen till the next lifetime. But in this lifetime, will we see, what will we see, if we see anything as far as Bill Barr paying the price for his crimes, for protecting Trump, for enabling Trump all those years? 
Okay. There's the karma. There he is with his hope and longing. Huh, that's interesting. And maybe it's him with his foreign connections. There we go. There's that health card again. And there's the daughter. Okay, because I think he did have a daughter with that had... Um, Oh, there's a painful ending and loss there. I think he had a daughter, or I don't know. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he had a daughter that had cancer. It was undergoing cancer treatments. There's the wife again. Okay. It's all about this family. Wow. Okay. So I don't know that we're going to see anything uh, legally coming down on him. But notice that we've drawn the bad card, our bad health card again, and the wife and the daughter, and the marriage, the bonds. The karma he has, we might see something as to the karma that he has with uh, money laundering, foreign connections. But this could also just be him using drugs and alcohol. I mean, wasn't didn't wasn't there something on the news about him sitting with John Durham and they'd have scotch, you know, in his office? Oh, I remember. I saw it on uh, Alex Wagner on her show. She talked about it. So this is him and his drinking and the health issues because of his drinking. And this is his daughter. This is his wife. They do all the work for him. And <laughs> maybe that's why she's had health problems. The daughter's had health problems. It's not good for women to be dependent on men. Anyway... This is him, and he thinks he has some control with his health, but it's going to come to a very painful ending. And his strategy is just with his family. Let's see what's at the bottom of this one. Okay, message, wealthy man, courtship. Yeah, again. Yeah, I, I, I'm, not, I'm not seeing, we just, I don't think we're going to see the legal issues come up for him. But he is on this, you know, new journey of uh, some type of teamwork, maybe some ambition, some. He, he's. I think. I really. I just keep getting that he's. He's trying to finalize. I think he knows he has health problems, and his whole family does. And I think he's trying to finalize things so that uh, there's maybe some uh, stability left for. There's. There must be grandchildren. And he's thinking, you know, along that way. And getting things, uh, legal documents together, trusts and wills, things like that. So, yeah. Okay. Again, I could be wrong with this, but this is what I'm getting. <laughs> Take care, you guys. Bye. <laughs>